Welcome to The Right Question, the video podcast designed to answer your questions about writing. I'm Daphne Gray Grant. Today I have a question from Catherine Womack from Belmont, Massachusetts. Catherine's an academic, and here's what she had to ask me. Hi, Daphne. This is Catherine calling. I have a question for you. When I'm constrained for time, for example, when I need to write, say, 750 words in two hours or less, I have a hard time figuring out how to manage that process. How would you suggest that I divide up the tasks associated with writing? Any advice would be really appreciated. Thanks, Catherine. The question of budgeting time is a really interesting one, and I've given it a lot of thought over the last 10 years. I used to be a senior editor at a daily newspaper where, believe me, the time pressure was intense. I think that helped make me more mindful of time management when I started my own writing business. Here are some ways to think about budgeting your time. Editing should usually take twice as long as writing. So if you spend 20 minutes on a piece, you should spend 40 minutes editing it. Here's another idea that surprises many people. Every piece of writing needs some incubation. This means giving your brain some time to transition from writing to editing. Just let the piece of writing sit for an hour and let the editing leprechauns do their work. Time away from your work is so essential because it gives you a little bit of distance from it. I even did this when I worked for a daily newspaper. Yes, the deadlines were really intense, and if I couldn't take the full hour, well, I'd do something distracting. I've included a link on incubating in the description below. Then, unless you've really backed yourself into a corner with your deadline, don't feel you have to finish a piece on the same day that you start it. So spend some time on day one thinking about the piece you want to write. Spend some time on day two writing it, and spend some time on day three editing it. This kind of budgeting of your time will give you more energy and lead to a better result. Finally, let me wrap up with a quote from motivational speaker Zig Ziglar. Lack of direction, not lack of time, is the problem. We all have 24-hour days. Thanks for your question, Catherine. Good luck with your budgeting. Thanks so much for watching. If you have a question for me, you can email, tweet, or Skype me. Details in the description below, along with any resources I've mentioned. And please don't forget to like and subscribe to the video.